Good looks, solid build, and great features make the ICOM ICT-10 Dual Band Radio our top premium pick for analog handhelds. As soon as you hold the radio, it becomes evident that the casing is impressive and worthy of the radio's IP67 rating. This implies the radio is dustproof and waterproof when submerged up to a depth of 1.5 meters for 30 minutes. There's also some shockproofing here, which makes this a great choice for the outdoors. As we talk of the looks and design, it's only natural to think of the display here, and that's the tiny screen sandwiched between the speaker and the keypad. Now, the tiny screen itself wouldn't be a problem, as it is quite common in this category. However, ICOM somehow decided to use a low resolution that shows only 8 characters and the alphabet casing can get mixed up. Since it can't handle uppercase characters very well, the menus and information display can feel weird. While not terrible aspect, it is annoying, especially for a premium radio. But there is redemption in the speaker. The big 1500 milliwatt speaker on the radio is loud, clear, and offers pretty good sound quality. This might indeed be the best speaker in this category. The ICT-10 continues with the high quality features with options like a channel control knob, a very satisfying to move volume and power control knob, and an easily managed keypad. It draws power from a BP-280 battery, 7.4 volts and 2200 milliampere hour, which can work up to 11 hours on a full charge. The performance is slightly above average for handheld transceivers. If desired, you can also hook it directly to DC power, though that will require an additional adapter AD149H. Other features include easy programming, 208 memory channels, tone scan, priority, and skip functions. Overall, this is a great radio with excellent features and an impressive build. Its main downside is its price, since it is priced significantly higher than other handheld analog ham radios like the Yaesu FT65R. And while it edges out Yesu on aspects like build quality and audio, it doesn't quite deliver a thumping win. To sum up what I like is the IP67 protection rating, dustproof and waterproof. The excellent build quality, it feels good to hold, the knob to switch channels, the output power at 5 watts, 2.5 watts, and 0.5 watts, the great audio quality with 1500 milliwatt speaker, and it's easy to program. On the downside, the tiny display can feel cramped, and it's expensive. Our rating for features is 8 out of 10, build quality 9 out of 10, battery 8.5. 5 out of 10. Audio quality, 9 out of 10. Value for money, 7.5 out of 10. For an overall rating of 8.5 out of 10.